Hello, my name is Randall Standridge, and I am the composer of the work you will be hearing next, The Nine. The Nine was written in honor of the Little Rock Central Nine, nine African-American students who were integrated into Little Rock Central High School in 1957 following the Supreme Court decision, Brown versus the Board of Education. This particular moment in history, especially during the Civil Rights Movement, was especially contentious as it brought forth the forces of progress and oppression into stark conflict and contrast. This work seems to illustrate that point through its use of a spiritual, an original spiritual that I wrote entitled Show Me the Light, which is set in contrast with more aggressive and militaristic music. These forces battle out before finally reaching their own mutual destruction, and from the ashes rises the anthem once again, Show Me the Light, building to a glorious conclusion. But the piece does end somewhat ambiguously, as you will hear, as we are asked to reflect, have we changed, and what is next? It is what I hope is a thought-provoking and emotional work, and I hope you will enjoy it. And as always, peace, love, and music. Sure. 
Hello, my name is Kristen Holmes. I'm a composer at the University of Maryland, and what you're about to hear is my piece titled Voyage, performed by the Dover Yoda High School Concert Band. I was asked to write this piece at around June 2020, which I feel like was kind of an awkward time for everyone. We were a couple months into a pandemic that we had no idea that was coming, and along with the pandemic of COVID-19 that we're still suffering through, we were and still are suffering through a pandemic of social and racial injustice. Personally, this made me feel very uneasy and unwell, and I'm sure that a lot of people also felt the same way. And I wanted to write a piece that also not only reflected my feelings at the time, but I also wanted to reflect something that everyone else was feeling as well. Another thing that I wanted to convey to my audience is pride. This concept of managing to get from point A to point B through this journey, this voyage, just being proud of yourself, taking a moment at the end, looking back at all the accomplishments that you have made throughout this difficult time, feeling proud of yourself and genuinely meaning that. And that's what this piece is, acknowledging that ambiguity in your life and that unwellness and kind of settling in it and also coming out at the end and celebrating. Before you listen to this piece, I would like to make a quick thank you to band director Ryan Anderson, the students of the Dover Iota High School Concert Band, the Minnesota Band Consortium for African American Composers, the MMEA, and all of you for listening. So thank you very much. I hope you enjoy. And here is my piece titled Voyage. Keep performing, keep creating, and keep music alive. Thank you.
My name is Michael Sweeney, and I'm honored to introduce the Dover Iota High School Concert Band performing Quad City Stomp. The piece was commissioned by the band department at Sherrod, Illinois, which is in the northwest portion of Illinois in the Quad Cities area. And naturally, that's where the title came from. The piece is in three parts. You have two uh, fast parts and a connecting middle slower section. The third part of the piece features sort of an, an Irish melody, and you'll hear the melody by itself first, then the harmony, and then finally the melody and the harmony put together. It was in the midst of writing this piece that my mother passed away and work on the piece stopped for a, a period of time. When I finally got back to writing the piece uh, and finished it off, I was finding that that third part of the piece was becoming sort of an Irish flavor. And I got in touch with the band director and, and apologized for the delay and explained the situation and uh, about the, the style of the piece. Uh, then he wrote back and, and said that I, I, he wasn't going to tell me this, but his wife had passed away. She was very Irish and would, would certainly approve of the direction that the piece had taken. So we soon realized that our, our departed loved ones were looking over this project. It's a celebration of, of dance and rhythm, of melody and harmony, and of love and life. And I'm proud now to present the Dover Iota High School Concert Band.
you forget how much fun it is. And, and I don't know about you guys, but this is the highlight of my week. It just happened. It was just, just wow. And, and so thank you for all of your extra effort to make music important. So um, anything before we call it a day? Sword. I, I believe we, we got the nine. I believe we got Voyage. Yesterday we got Quad City Stomp. 